Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, we just got done with round one of the Silk and Baron Zemo arena. Baron Zemo was in the basic. Silk is the new champion coming into the contest. Now, I actually went for Baron Zemo. I don't have him as a six star. And even though he has been or is going to be nerfed pretty badly, I still want to grab champions I don't have, um, especially as six stars. So I did go for him. And this is my, I think this is my first time going for a basic champion since they changed the cutoff to 400, I believe. Um, I don't think I've gone for a six star in the basic since then. So we're going to see how I did. I, I think I overdid it a little bit. You know how I do. Um, and for Silk, I'm going to go for a five star next round. Not going for the six star. I will probably grab the six star just like how I'm grabbing uh, Zemo. Um, I'll grab. Well, that's interesting. Just got a, a message from <laughs> a, a comment on one of my uh, live streams. I don't usually get those. Uh, but anyway, let's take a look. Um, of course, I finished off the um, T1 Alpha. And that's all I'm going to be doing uh, today. Okay. I think I overdid it a little bit, guys. I was pretty sure I overdid it. Uh, rank 11. Yeah. I think I overdid that a little bit. Uh, and of course, I just went for the uh, milestones there. And as you can see, I got everything. Um, and I will grab the five star next round. All right. Want to see what I put up? That's what I put up. Now, if you look at my live stream, the um, prediction was around 40. But I think I told someone. Um, they were saying, man, your your cutoff uh, prediction was way off. And I told them I always go for the super safe score. And I don't recommend a score that I wouldn't do. And I think one of them, I, I did put up like 60 million as a prediction. And I told them that's what I would do. Well, here's the proof. That's what I did. And it was way overkill. Way, way overkill. Uh, and that's pretty much... Hey, congratulations, Lord Shadow. And that's pretty much what we were figuring because of the news that um, Root is going to be changed in such a way that people want rank down tickets. That's how bad it is for Zemo. And uh, they were told they're not going to get him. So uh, the hype that he had before gone um but it was still within that uh six month window and that's why they're thinking ah, maybe they don't need to give anybody anything because they've already warned people yada 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 um that is a good reason for me to go for champs when they come to the basic because that will be after they have decided whether they're going to nerf them or not you know um there's a chance that they can buff them as well. But usually it's uh, a matter of whether they're going to leave them the same or they're going to nerf them. And that nerf may be a bug fix. It doesn't matter what brings about the nerf. If they are less effective than they currently are, it's a nerf. Um, so, uh, but anyway, I have the uh, champion. This level up, I'll probably take him up. He's still a good champion, but I knew people were upset. And I don't blame them with uh, what they've done. Um, he's still good on defense as well. I don't think that that uh, change is going to really affect him that way. Uh, it's going to take away, if I remember correctly, uh, one thing that really made him OP and why he was so hyped. Uh, the issue that a lot of people have is that 
Kabam seems to like to wait until they've made as much as they could and then, but that could just be our perception, you know. Uh, they posted a bug fix on a board that they know people don't really uh, go to and most people don't even know about. Uh, and to me, that was more of a CYA type of a move. Uh, knowing that, if you really want people to know, put it in game. Give an in-game message. And you'll be guaranteed that people who are playing are going to know and even if they've not been playing for a while, they'll be told. But that, to me, is the best way to let people know of something like that. But anyway, I got him. And I will probably take him up to three uh, when I have the resources to. Um, and we will go from there. Mr. Lightning Bolt. Cat. Yeah, I, I'm not expecting. Eh, I'm not expecting um, to see a lot of uh, names that I recognize. In fact, I don't. I don't see anyone that I personally know. I've seen names that uh, I've seen on the leaderboards, but a lot of these names are new to me, and I'm not surprised. Not surprised at all. Yeah, definitely not surprised. Um, all right, let's take a look at Silk. Now, I've heard some good things about Silk, mainly her damage. However, um, Maniac, what is up? Oh, dear. That's odd. Check this out. It's blank, right? But look. See? At first, I thought the power went out, and I'm like, I didn't, uh, my battery is, is not, yeah, see, 79%. I'm going to hope. Let me, okay. Whew. Hey, it's back. That was weird. I was like, please don't tell me my, my, my lighting died or my screen died or something like that. Um, okay. Whew. That I definitely would not need right now. Uh, but anyway, um, as hyped as, as her damage seems to be, I would like to remind people of what just happened with Zemo. Uh, Dipper Jones, congratulations. Um. Just keep in mind that you have six months, I believe, to find out whether they suddenly feel that she's doing way too much damage and will be nerfed. Uh, J4 is awesome. Congratulations. So just keep that in mind. Um, that's really killed my desire to go for a lot of these champions right when they come in because I don't really know what I'm going to get until about six months and by that time they're in the basic and as you can see the basic is for me anyway much easier to pick up champions i could have grabbed this champion um i think i had him given that i got rank 11 uh laser john congratulations i think i got i had him after probably on the second day and I, I didn't even start until um, the next day. Simula. Hmm. Okay. Fuzz. Congratulations, man. That's a name I haven't seen in a while. So, yeah. I, I Yankee for life. Congratulations. I knew he was going for her. But, like I said, I... Uh, she looked good, but, um, yeah. KT1, congratulations. Yeah, I, I think I will grab her as the five-star. And if she's good and she remains good in six months, I will pick her up in the uh, basic. 
Wish you luck. Congratulations. Yeah, see, this is this is where all the names and people I know, uh, that's what they want. And of course, a lot of them probably already have uh, uh, Zemo picked him up from. I didn't really um, open up a lot of um, featured when he was in the featured. So I just said, you know what? I'm just going to open up basics, get more seven star shards and grab him in uh, the basic arena. And that's pretty much uh, what I'm going to be doing for a little while. Uh, seems to be uh, much simpler, much easier for me. All right. Giovanni. Love that name. And yeah, Sanmio. Uh, I don't believe that's our Sanmio. And if it is, I haven't seen him around the stream in like ages. And I haven't heard anything from him so but anyway guys that is gonna do it i got me a baron zemo i will take him up he will probably go in um uh in my battlegrounds deck and annoy people <laughs> uh but take care i'm about to go and take myself a nice little nap nice sunday afternoon nap uh take care and you all have a blessed day.